they say in her name, family housing. Usually that's what it is. My family needs housing. And they make a call and they contact us. Then what we do is we go through what's called an initial, I would say, assessment of what they need. And that's based on the story that they tell us. How did you get here? But there is a lot of stigma in asking for help. And a lot of people have preconceived notions on what that is to receive assistance, who that would be, what that person looks like, and it's very different from them. Homelessness is not what we think it is. It has different faces and different stories. Meet Anne, a single mother of two and a four-year college graduate who worked in her industry for eight years. I always made good money. I never, I, I did the right thing. I was paying my student loans. I was doing the right thing, what I was supposed to be doing. I was adulting after college. <laughs> Due to outsourcing in March of 2017, Anne lost her job. So I continued to pay my bills as normal, pay daycare, pay rent uh, while I was looking for a job. And when the funds ran out, I found myself homeless, literally. The day before this interview was filmed, she accepted a full-time position. I kind of just felt like people are homeless because they make certain decisions, they make the wrong decisions. And now I understand that there are people that are homeless because of circumstances you can't control. For the Omaha News, I'm Gloria Espahel.